decrease, not here. Let's decrease the field. And here, I can freeze the image. Clearly, you have your bad side, plural line. We saw the line sliding. And at this distance, which is the skin plural line distance, we have the repetition of the plural line. And this is the A line, what we called A line. A line with lung sliding is normal lung surface. This is at the anterior chest wall what we call the A profile. So A profile is expected in this gentleman who is completely healthy. The next step is to see in our progression the lung rockets. Lung rockets are not expected in a healthy subjects but we can see from time to time lateral lung rockets just before the lung or the spleen, before the liver or the spleen, and often you can see isolated beelines anteriorly. So here, this man has no lateral locations, but if we go at this point, we will often have line that you can see here. You can see this is a artifact with seven criteria. That's a commit style artifact arising from the plural line, moving with lung sliding, long, Way defined like a laser, white like the plural line, hyperechoic, you see, same density, and erasing the A lines. You don't see an A line usually with a B line. That makes seven criteria which allows to say confidently this gentleman has a B line. Here it is expected that's usually the minor fissura, but he has not three B lights at the same intercostal space, which is also expected. We just define the PLAPS point now. So PLAPS is posterolateral alveolar and or pleural syndrome that should be located posteriorly. And we will scan the posterior of the lung in a ventilated patient. So, you remember the lower blue point was here, and we just continue transversally the lower blue point, and we will put our probe exactly here. The more the probe is short, the easier you come posteriorly, and the easier you can compare your lung scanning with CAT scan. So, you put the probe this way, as posterior as you can, as perpendicular to the chest wall as you can, and you are quite posterior. And so we will see later that the good position is when the operator does not see the probe. The probe is hidden by the hand and by the chest wall. 